SABC3 stellar lineup of local shows will be welcoming a new addition tomorrow night, um, a crime drama called The Docket, about an elite crime fighting unit forced to tackle their perpetrators under the scrutiny of the media. Actress Zakia Patel, who plays journalist Lexi Patel in the series, is joining Expresso to share more ahead of the premiere on SABC3 tomorrow night at 9 30 p.m. Welcome Zaki. everybody. Yeah. Zaki, yes, <laughs> we're about that life. Girl, you are doing amazing. Mm. It's going to be so wonderful to see you in this fresh new show. Tell us more about your character, Lexi Patel. Back on screen. So, Lexi Patel is a very ambitious journalist. She yeah. writes for Modern Millennials, which is a youth publication, but she's not particularly happy on that yeah. uh, on working on something like that she yeah. has bigger ambitions than that mm. she has a huge huge social media following yeah. but she wants something more and that's the real stories okay. oh, wow. and she's also willing to do oh. underhanded what it, things oh, what it, <laughs> I would say, yeah, she's willing to do whatever it takes to get those stories i mean she's in a male dominated industry yeah. she's going to push as hard and as fast as she can yeah. and she doesn't really mind whose toes she stands on and she stands oh wow okay. on some toes oh, okay. oh, oh. Oh, man, oh, I can't really see this. this is so exciting. But I mean, there's so many, you know, um, crime dramas in the country. You know, they become really, really popular. What's what's so different about this, the docket that you're on? What's different about the docket is these stories are based on actual events that have happened in South Africa and have been solved by our SAPS. Mm. So they are real stories, and the the characters. I mean, when I read the script, I literally sat there screaming to my. I don't know if he was my husband or fiancé lover at the, stage. At the time. <laughs> Rob, you have no idea what just... <laughs> and I, I, I couldn't read it fast enough. Yeah. Every single time one script came out, I would guzzle through it no matter where yeah. I was. I mean, I remember yeah. stopping my car at a shopping centre yeah. in the sweltering heat of Joburg in, some, in October last year. Yeah. And literally, I was like, I, I need my aircon to work, but I need to drive for that to yeah. happen, but I yeah. also need to read the script. Wow. Um, it's gripping stuff. And the, for me... Gosh, the actors. We have Shubi, oh. we have uh, Ashish Ganga Prasad, we have an amazing new actor, Brandel, mm. Brandon Engelbrecht, yeah. um, Duncan Johnson, uh, Seputla. We've got so many amazing wow. people in the cast. And it's just, you can see the dynamic on set. It's yeah. A, it's a masterclass in acting, yeah. but B, the chemistry is electrifying. I mean, wow. the show, I would say, is a ticking time bomb. Oh, a ticking time bomb we are. Ooh. Yeah, for. That's, a, that's <laughs> lovely. That's lovely. That's I'm a guessing hint. in this show, none of the dockets actually go missing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I just had to. No, <laughs> well, the no. new crime fighting series, The no. Dockers, premieres tomorrow night on SABC3 at 9.30 p.m. So be sure not to miss the hottest <laughs> new addition to our local entertainment lineup. And, of course, we'll be having more fun with a gorgeous actress and presenter, Zakia Patel, later on. So make sure you keep it locked to your feet. Feel Good Breakfast Show. Let's talk about things we would rather talk about, which is none other than you, <laughs> Mrs. Zakia Patel, because uh, we don't care about no Kardashians <laughs> and everything. But let's first talk about you and, of course, you're in a brand new space in your life. You've got this Yay. brand new show, The Docket, starting. And uh, you've... You've been married for a while now. Yes. Tell us more about married life. It's been a year, hasn't it? Nearly a year. Yeah? Everyone asks, what's married life like? And the only difference is that either I need an undertaker or a lawyer to get rid of him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad you laughed. Some people are like, is it that bad already? No, it's not that bad already. That's just a joke. But um, I've always loved, I've always been the type of person who yeah. loves, you know, the fireworks of a new relationship yeah. and, the, and that feeling and the new and all the sparkly yes. stuff. And then I've always been of the thought process that, you know, then it gets mundane and boring yeah. and every day. But I was reading an article recently, and she said, actually, when you're dating, you do the same thing. You know, yeah. you tell them about the same songs and the same yeah. stories. and the, So you actually pull the same sort of routine on someone, and that's yeah. boring. You know? Yeah. you know your moves. You know your best outfit. You know those exactly, things. Exactly. But what's interesting is when you've been with someone long enough, then they're learning new things about you all yeah. the time. 
you know, because you, the old stories, you can't rely on those. It's yeah. the new things and the new adventures. Yeah. So I really like that way of looking at, awesome. at at being in a relationship. Obviously, because I'm married, I decided to spend my life with one human. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> well, a very good-looking human. And listen, be Aww. glad that you found your person, because the modern world of dating, girl, you don't want to be involved I, in I it. I have heard the horror uh -huh. story. Uh -huh. Be they glad that many you found horror your horror stories. <laughs> <laughs> but, Sikia, there's some exciting things also coming up with Mela. I mean, yes. you're a part of it. They're always sending you guys on awesome adventures. What are some of the things we can expect in the next couple of weeks? So one of the amazing things about Mela are the people we get to meet not just the food yeah. <laughs> whenever people stop me on the road they're like how about that curry I've gotten so fat because of all the ghee yes I'm sure I am sure you have but it's about the people and the stories we're telling I mean yeah. this month the heritage month is coming up so it's stories of South Africans who are really injecting their energy into South Africa and building South Africa up there's so much amazing food <laughs> on the way um, but definitely the people. The people is the most yeah. exciting thing yeah. about the show. Love it. So you've got Mela, which is rocking our screens. The docket will be rocking our screens Yay! as well. What is up next for Zakia Patel? More screen rocking. Lovely. Yeah. <laughs> so there's a movie releasing in January. What? The 25th of January, 2019. It's actually around the corner. This year is going so it's fast. Yeah. It's called Three Days to Go. It's a family dramedy, so drama comedy. And I play a very young mother, uh, almost teenage mother, okay. who has two boys and is dabbling in drugs and is kind of on the wilder side wow. of things, which is a huge change in the type of roles I've taken on. Mm. I usually take on quite powerful, uh, sassy women, and yeah. she is definitely sassy, but um, quite, I think you could say, broken. Mm. And I remember I was working with my acting coach before we started shooting, and she was asking me to tell me about this this, this young woman, and I was like, she's a hoe. <laughs> and, and literally, the, the first thing I did was I judged this person. Yeah, of course, yeah. And my acting coach said to me, you know what we have, and we have this lucky job, and I'm so glad she reminded me, uh, of not just portraying a character emotionally or physically uh, or psychologically, but there's a spiritual side to performing, mm -hmm. and we get to tell people stories like a, a mother who had children young who is finds herself in abusive relationships or in relationships with married men and what you're doing is you're giving the person in South Africa who watches the movie a chance to have their journey and to have a cathartic wow. journey of that so yeah. there's a spiritual side of telling someone's story yeah. and I've never judged a character again because you can't I mean these stories have happened to young women out there and there are reasons there are, yeah. there are pains and truths and deeper things behind the hoe so I was so, so um, privileged to yeah. tell someone's story. That's powerful. I can't yeah. wait to see them. That's in January <laughs> yes. of 2019. Yes. Yes. Three days to go. Yes. Wow. Super Absolutely exciting. Amazing. Well, Sakia, thank you so much for joining us thank this morning. And me. make sure you catch the docket at premieres tomorrow yes. night. That's on SABC 3 at 9.30. It's the docket, so make sure you do not miss it.